Just about 6.45 here on your Tuesday morning, we have continuing coverage now of the UAW strike. Today, hundreds of local auto workers who were just laid off at the Ford engine plant in Brook Park can begin signing up for strike pay. Local 1250 spokesperson Pat Wallace joins us now live from outside the UAW Local 1250 Union Hall where those workers can register. And Pat, this morning, what is your message to those laid off workers and what do they need to know? Uh, first thing, good morning to all our UAW workers and all you guys. Uh, Basically, we're, so we're signing, uh, signing up strike folks for $500 pay and health care uh, this morning. For those that will look at that $500 that they're going to get in strike pay, that obviously is not enough to cover all their expenses. Does there become a point where the workers start to feel the impact of that financially and go, hey, maybe we should get to a deal here? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, uh, the anxiety is high in our plant for a deal to come to, cl to close uh, in a quick matter. Uh, but unfortunately, uh, right now, we're standing strong, right? We're doing what we can do. Uh, locally, we have a food bank set up in our hall uh, where donations have been dropped off for the uh, members. So if they get in a, a hunger crunch, should you say, uh, they're more than welcome to come here and pick up some uh, uh, food that we have. I know you said anxiety is high. What are some of the concerns that you're hearing this morning? Uh, like you mentioned, right, uh, being out longer, $500 a week in today's economy is not stretching very far, as we all know. Uh, that's why the UAW is pushing for, you know, the working class folks to maintain uh, a good cost of living and a good standard of living. And what's the morale like? Uh, I know at the beginning of this strike, you know, I talked to workers in Toledo at the Stellantis plant the morning of that, you know, first day. Um, and they were saying, hey, we're in it for the long haul. It was kind of like a party atmosphere. They were very much into it. We're several weeks into this strike now. Is that still the case or is their concern starting to really set in? Uh, our morale continues to be high. Uh, we're standing strong. We're standing in line. Uh, we're hoping, you know, that we get a fair and equitable deal. Uh, once this is resolved, but our membership is uh, standing strong, even though the weather's turning a little uh, Ohio weather on us, uh, we're continue to stand strong. All right, Pat Wallace, thank you so much for joining us this morning. We appreciate it. All right, thank you. Have a great day. You too. Thank you.